Hey, so this is it. This is the last early morning drive in to do the Rob's radio show on KISS FM. And I gotta tell you, it felt really good to turn those alarms off this morning and know that I'm not gonna be waking up at five or four anything on Monday morning. Um, but I will tell you that I am incredibly sad to be leaving the show. And I've said it before and I will say it again. This is incredibly bittersweet. Um, you know, I, I love doing the morning show with Rob. We have so much fun. And I love each and every one of you. And I just... It was a really hard decision to make to uh, hang up my headphones on the show and move into the position of brand manager and move over to uh, our sister station to GBF. Um, but it is, it is, you know, it was my career goal. That was what I've always, that's what I've wanted to do. When I started radio, that was it. Um, and that opportunity presented itself and I had to take it. I mean, I couldn't not, I couldn't not. And But it is so bittersweet. You know, I have I have enjoyed so much out of the last six years, uh, being able to make you laugh, uh, make you cry. God knows I've cried plenty of times on the radio. Um, you know, broadcasting live and having you come out to say hi, um, and just all of the phone calls over the years and all the times we played the last letter game or, you know, anytime Rob and I got into a disagreement on the air and you guys would, you, you would call in and, you know, oh, I side with Kat on this, Rob. It just... This is a really hard day. It's going to be a hard day. Um, but I... I want you to know how incredibly grateful I am for the last six years, and the last six years wouldn't be possible without you. Um, without you turning us on in the mornings between six and ten, at home and in the car and you know at work, I wouldn't have had the opportunity to do this for the last six years, and. I am so immensely grateful for that opportunity. Now, they're going to put somebody else in the chair. Somebody else is going to sit in the chair. Somebody else is going to sit behind that microphone. And I don't know who that's going to be. They haven't told me. I don't know if they know yet. And that's okay. But I have something really important. I have the biggest favor to ask of you. I know that we don't like change. As people, we just don't. We don't like change. And I know that when Rob and I first took over doing mornings on KISS, it was a big change for, you know, thousands of people in the area that were listening and you know, tens of thousands of people that were listening. And they, they weren't amused <laughs> that we had taken away what they were used to and given them something new and different. People don't like change. And it's very easy to sit on your phone or at your computer and express your disapproval of those kinds of changes. But it's also, there's also a human being on the other side of that who is receiving those messages who is seeing things like, you're not good enough, or, you know, we don't like you. And that's a very hard position to be in because that's the position that Rob and I were in. And I was not prepared for that. And it was uh, an incredibly difficult transition for me. I was not in the least bit prepared for just how mean people were going to be. As time went on, that got easier, and, and it went from, you know, she's awful, and get her off the radio, to, you know, we love her, and she's our favorite, and that's, 
that's fine, but those people that were so mean, I don't remember their names, but I remember how I felt those first several weeks. So, my favor from you is that whoever they bring in to fill this chair and to sit behind that microphone, give them a chance and be nice. You don't have to love them right away. You probably will. After a few months, I bet you will. I bet you're going to love them to the moon. But if you don't right away, that's okay. Just don't send hateful messages. And don't call Rob and tell him how much this other person isn't what you think they should be. Because that other person is going to be sitting in the room with Rob and they're going to hear it. Even if they don't speak and you don't hear them on the phone... They're going to be there. And it's a really difficult position to be in. So I'm begging you. Be nice. Be nice and show them some love that I know you're capable of because you, you're amazing. You are all absolutely amazing. And I am so grateful. I am so grateful for the last six years.